Hi, I'm Rom. I'm the author of Vid Plugging SSR, which is similar to Framex like Next.js and Nuxt, but as a do one thing, do it well with plugin. Um, it's slightly lower level, so it means that you need to write a little bit more boilerplate code. But on, on the other hand, it gives you a lot more flexibility. So for example, you can use Vid, Vid Plugin SSR with any tool you want, any UI framework, React, Vue, Svelte, Solid, etc. You can deploy it any way you want. And to this day, there's not a single use case that couldn't be achieved with Vid Plugin SSR. So in a nutshell, with Vid Plugin SSR, you keep architectural control. What some users have been doing with that control is that they, they've been building their own framework. And one use case that is particularly interesting is building company internal frameworks. Um, so for example, uh, Wittberg SSR sponsor is using, is using it uh, to deeply integrate Relay with React 18 new SSR suspense architecture. And um, that's something, by the way, they couldn't have achieved with Next.js. But anyways, um, building company internal frameworks is a powerful idea. Um, because companies, especially large companies, struggle to scale their development teams. Um, one major reason for that is because companies, especially large companies, have a wide range of engineering skills. So on one hand, you have the highly technical developers who uh, care, but they, they want control. They want to be able to use any tool they want, and they want to be able to integrate tools however they want. Um, on the other hand, you have the more product developers who care less about technicalities, and the, what they care about is shipping features and shipping features quickly. So building company internal framework is a powerful way to resolve that tension between a high diverse, uh, high diversity of engineering, engineering skills. And an interesting aspect of this is that your company internal framework can include everything. Uh, frameworks like Next.js and Next only include the front end. But your company internal framework can include everything, the backend, the front end, authentication, the API layer, error tracking, logging, etc. So it means that your product developers, the only thing they have left to do is define UI components and business logic. So it's a dream come true for your product developers. And it's also a dream come true for your highly technical developers because they get to build your company internal framework and they keep architectural control. They can use any tool they want uh, and, they integrate, and they can integrate the tools however they want. Um, so it's a dream come true for both ends of the spectrum. Um, so I highly encourage you to build your own framework, to scale your development teams and to ship features as fast as never before. Thanks for watching.